Okay, uh, what this question asks me to do is graph this problem in for, uh, from vertex form. So I know it's going to be a parabola. Um, in vertex form, though, I need to remember what vertex form is, and that's a times x minus h squared plus k. All right, there's a couple things we need to remember. Our k is going to tell us to shift up or down. Our h is going to tell us to shift to the right or shift to the left. And our a is going to tell us when we're going to do any kind of um, stretching or compressing. So let's first look at what a parabola looks like. All right, that's just a rough sketch of my parabola. And what you guys notice is, um, you know, of this parabola, it's infinitely going this way, this way, all right? It has its vertex over at 0, 0. So what I can do whenever I'm graphing a problem, um, and it's given in vertex form, which this equation is, I can see what are my transformations. Well, let's look at this. I have a minus 2, so that's going to tell me my h is going to be, um, I actually have a, if you think about this, all right, I know it's kind of confusing, but it's x minus h, right? So really, my h is equal to 2, because x minus 2, x minus h. So therefore, h is equal to 2. That means I'm going to shift 2 to the right. So I'm going to shift over 2 to the right. Then, if you notice, I don't have a k, so I can rewrite that as plus 0. All right? So to regraph this problem, all I'm really doing is I just have to move my graph over two units to the right. My A is not going to sh um, compress or stretch it at all. Or and if this was negative, that would reflect about the x-axis. But I don't have one of those. So all I need to do is graph one point from there. So it's really important to make sure that when you're graphing parabolas, you understand what it is in vertex form, and you understand what H is and what K and how they affect the graph. Now, if I had an A, one thing I would do is, I, you know, you can make, once you find your vertex, plug in a point to the left and plug in a point to the right into your equation just to make sure that um, you have the correct points. But like I said, from here, it's just going to be your standard parabola, just your graph shifted two units to the right.